Hope you're sitting comfortably. Uh, then I'll begin. You're thinking it's all becoming plain now, aren't you? Boarding school. Stuck in a house away from society. That's the machine up there, look, providing all the power. I wonder how many people live in the countryside and nobody knows they're there. It's difficult to know because nobody knows they're there. Come along, catch a half a lump. Sip with me on a muddy clump. You can come in at two in the afternoon and he's comatose on the floor asleep because he's had such a bad night the night before. If you want a drink, leave the money behind the bar. Because he's fucked. <laughs> I've got such a long criminal record now that I'm just looked on as an agitator. Do you never ever, ever consider having children? Is it not something that you... No. <laughs> I would 99% say no chance. There's something nice about the feeling that you get kind of like hiding away in the woods. I think you've just got to be bold and do it. You could be dead here for four days and nobody wouldn't know you was here. I've tried that normal life with the, with the house and everything else and um, don't like it really. Just like the simple things and living in nature. Come, come, come. Engaged rather a lot of times, so maybe six or seven times, something like that. But they didn't come from Portugal, uh, well, they come from Britain. <laughs> I starve sometimes, but I don't mind starving and being warm, because that's comfortable. But if you starve and you're cold, that's a different matter altogether. Slowed up for over three weeks, but luckily I keep food for about three weeks anyway, just in case. I am 86, but <laughs> luckily I can walk and <laughs> carry hods of anthracite. Don't worry. Uh, no, who? Why would I be worried? Beast from the east. Nearly fucking killed me, really. It's not that people would be malicious, but maybe. People might, it might start off as a positive story that's told and then I'd be devastated if I had to take this down. People, they're all striving for tomorrow, which doesn't exist, and moaning about yesterday, which doesn't exist. And they all forget about living today. Today I'm sat in a funny little red leather chair by a fire, smoking a fag in a pub. Is that crazy or what? <laughs> You can't cut your own head off. I tried it. It doesn't work. <laughs>